put this out there. I did not enjoy being married a lot. Why did you cry when you brought up my So, I make videos. Who is the greatest YouTuber of all time? The competition for the title of the greatest content creator on the world's most popular video streaming platform is as close as it gets. But we think we may have an answer. Surely you would consider this amazing YouTuber who has been on the platform for 13 years and created over 700 videos. Not convinced by that? Okay, consider this. He has 95 million subscribers on his main channel and close to 200 million combined across all six channels. And he has pulled lifetime views of over 23 billion. Yes, you heard that right, billion with a B. Still unconvinced? Then get a load of this mind-blowing fact. He emerged as the highest paid YouTube content creator of 2021, earning more revenue than the likes of BTS, Billie Eilish, and Kim Kardashian. If you are still on the fence, the fact that he has influenced the world around him so positively bringing tears, the happy kind, to thousands of people with his logic-defying acts of philanthropy and contributing greatly to humanity's fight against climate change, well, that should do it for you. Are you convinced now? Of course you are. What's the name of this spectacular individual? He goes by the name Mr. Beast. You know you're doing something right when the least interesting thing about you is an eyebrow-raising name like Mr. Beast. The inspirational 23-year-old American is the picture-perfect representation of relentless persistence and focus level not even all the Adderall in the world could stimulate. Life went as far as throwing him a diagnosis of chronic, debilitating disease at him when he was just 15 years old. And that still wasn't enough to stop him from evolving into one of the planet's most famous entertainers and philanthropists. We bet you want to hear the story of how all this came to be, don't you? Well, that's exactly what this video covers. So follow us as we dive into the belly of the beast. Before he mastered the fine art of making viral videos that earned him a mouthwatering payday of $54 million in 2021, before he changed the lives of thousands with giveaways estimated to be up to 20 million before he even knew what YouTube was, Mr. Beast was just another kid growing up in Greenville, North Carolina. He was born Jimmy Donaldson on May 7, 1998, and raised by a single mother alongside his older brother. Right from his preschool age, young Jimmy has always been different from most kids. He did not have many friends and social interactions and was very fixated on his personal interests. His mom described him as intense and passionate about whatever it was he was working on at the time. At the same time, Mr. Beast himself recalls being consumed by the things he liked. What was his first obsession? No, it wasn't a camcorder. It was Lego sets. This was replaced by baseball by the time he was 10 years old. He progressed through the ranks well enough, starting in the Little League and in the Babe Ruth League. But there was just one problem. Jimmy sucked at socializing. Badly. So he needed something else to channel his time and energy into something that did not need him to do much face-to-face -face interaction. Enter the next obsession, the only one that actually stuck, YouTube. Day and night, every free time he could get, Jimmy would spend his time watching videos on YouTube. He was practically inseparable from his older brother's rundown PC, where he could sit for hours consuming content. All he wanted to do was talk about YouTube, but no one he knew cared about it then. Well, except for one, Chris Tyson, who would go on to become his first subscriber, best friend, and ever-present collaborator. Then he learned he could go from content consumer and creator and get paid for it. Wait a minute, you can actually make money doing this? He recalls thinking to himself, blown away by the possibilities. That sealed it for him. He had found his future career. While his peers aspired to be doctors, lawyers, and engineers, 12-year-old Jimmy Donaldson had this crazy idea of becoming a full-time professional YouTuber. He created his channel by the name Mr. V6000. He randomly generated Xbox gamer tags and proceeded to post his first video. He hit the jackpot at the first go, gaining 20,000 views on the video of him running commentary on an old game called Battle Pirates. It wasn't like he needed further encouragement, but if there was any doubt in his mind, the 20,000 views certainly cleared them up. He went ahead to upload similar commentary style videos where he would humorously comment on events as he played through the video games. He was having the time of his life till an unexpected setback hit him from out of the blue at age 15. 
who was diagnosed with Crohn's disease. This painful inflammatory condition affects the digestive system by preventing absorption of nutrients. Mr. Beast lost 41 pounds in only a few months and barely had any energy to do anything. He felt weak, lethargic, and miserable. He felt like he had hit rock bottom. Crohn's disease is incurable, but with the help of great doctors and his supportive mom, he was able to get the symptoms under control and was back to making YouTube videos. This time, he went all in and uploaded a new video every day for three months straight. He changed his content strategy and did more of skits and funny videos with his buddy Chris Tyson. A channel had to be really big on YouTube to make any money at the time. So he had to scrounge up any cash he could find to buy new equipment to improve the quality of his videos. It took him 75,000 views to make his first $100. But it was never about the money for him. He had found genuine happiness creating and sharing videos. His account growth in followers and views was no more than a bonus to Mr. Beast. That happiness was threatened when he turned 18 and his mom insisted he go to community college. I never wanted to go to college. My whole goal in all of high school was to never go to college. His mom, who had a military background, having spent 21 years in active duty, was having none of it. Going to college and moving out of the house was the mandate. He did enroll in college, but he had zero intentions of sitting through hours and hours of classes. He went into full beast mode, pun fully intended, and doubled down harder than ever on YouTube. He got really crazy and frankly weird with his concepts, like the one where he spent hours cutting a table in half with only plastic knives, or the one where he sat down for 40 hours counting out loud every single digit from 1 to 100,000. It wasn't all just dumb luck though. He studied YouTube in depth and micro-analyzed every detail. He went as far as checking thumbnails to see if there were any correlation between their brightness and how many views they got. That's just insane, isn't it? But he eventually cracked the formula to going viral consistently and it started paying off. Soon enough, he made enough to move out of his mother's house and to live life on his own terms. By 2017, he was consistently making money on YouTube and had pioneered the genre of videos that revolved around wild and expensive stunts. Then later that year, he backed his first brand deal when Quid offered him $5,000 to put an ad on his video. Mr. Beast turned that down and proposed an incredible counteroffer. He wanted $10,000 and he wanted to give all of that away to a homeless person. We know. It doesn't make sense to us either, but that is exactly what he did. As selfish as it sounds, I like helping people because it just makes me happy. He continues, so I had this idea. If I take this branded money and gave it away in a video, that video would do well. And I could take that money from the video and that video would do well. Then I could create this cycle. I could use brands to help me help people. His channel became the home of crazy stunts and cash giveaways, and more often, both happened in the same video. By 2018, he had given away more than $1 million on his channel, including a $100,000 gift to his mom to help pay for her hours. A touching and beautiful tribute indeed. Who's tearing up? You are. From that point forward, there was no stopping Mr. Beast. His subscribers and views doubled at hyper speed. He expanded his empire on YouTube and created more channels. Mr. Beast Gaming, Beast Philanthropy, Beast Reacts, and Mr. Beast Shorts. He also has his content dubbed in Spanish, Portuguese, and Japanese by some of the world's biggest voice actors, increasing his reach further and wider. His acts of philanthropy also expanded in regularity and size of donations. During the pandemic, he gave away millions of dollars to people who had lost their jobs and donated 2 million meals to his community. He bought out an entire grocery store and donated everything to food shelters. He opened the world's first free restaurant for a day, causing a line of cars that stretched up to 20 miles long. The more money he made, the more he gave away. And the more money he gave away, the bigger his account got, and the more money he made again. Maybe God really does love a cheerful giver. For most of his audacious stunts, yes, there's more. Mr. Beast has set out to plant 20 million trees around the planet. 
He's doing this first of its kind project in collaboration with Mark Rober and the Arbor Day Foundation. He announced this challenge with a fundraising event, hashtag Team Trees, that sought donations of $20 million with the pledge to plant a tree for every dollar donated. Hashtag Team Trees went on to surpass the target by $3.7 million. They began planting trees on January 1st, 2020, with a deadline of December 2022 to hit this target. As of April 2022, 13.7 million trees have been planted thanks to this team's effort spearheaded by Mr. Beast. Will they hit their target before the deadline? Smart money will be to back Mr. Beast, a man who breathes and lives to make the world a better place.